Hello everybody, welcome back to my channel. This is my first video of me doing commentary. A little bit awkward, but um, I know some of you guys have heard my voice already on my LRG Live channel. I'll put the, a, a link to that in the description down below. Um, if you guys are new, if you guys can please subscribe. We are cl really close to 300 subscribers. And I want to meet that goal because I never, I don't know, this is crazy to me, you know. It's crazy, 300 subscribers. Well, I have 253 right now. I'm still grateful for that. I really do appreciate you guys supporting me for, uh, throughout two years, one year. I don't know how long. I think it's been two years, actually. If you guys haven't noticed, we are doing a new series on the channel. It's called Career Series. Everything will be realistic. Everything will be perfect. Um, I don't know how else to word it, but everything's just gonna be realistic, like in real life, but it's a, it's a game, you know what I mean? Um, yeah, we got, we are working for Swift Transportation, that's my first job, got my class, I just got my CDL, like, a week ago or something, and got Class A CDL. Now we're working for Swift. It's, I mean, it's a good starter job, I guess, but it's something, you know. The rates are pretty low, though, so I don't know how long I'm going to be working for this company. We'll see what happens in the future. Let's go start the truck up. Got a Cummins X15 in here by Z Mods. It's a pretty good engine. I do like it a lot. We're gonna turn on the lights and we are going to put our hatches on and we're gonna do our do our pre-trip really quick. Okay, so we got front lights, everything is working on the front lights, high beams are working. Do a quick walk around the truck. Okay, lights. Make sure our kingpin is in here. We got our lights on, and the kingpin is locked. Out of here. Uh, lights are working. Lights are working. Blinker is working. Go back here. Got the lights working, and brake lights are working. We're gonna go around again. Check the tires. Actually, I forgot to do that. Tires are good. Got the lights working on this side too. Um, especially over here. Forgot about that, but we're going to go under here again. Check the tires. Tires are good, as usual. I already did my truck. Trucking. I just did my tractor. I haven't done my tractor. But I know my truck is for sure good to go. I'm 100% positive. So, yeah, we're going to get inside the cab and go drive this baby. We got good old Freightliner Cascadia. Um, we got the digital dash. Basic Kenworth. Not Kenworth. Uh, basic Freightliner. You know pretty nice in here got that in the background pretty nice we are currently in Denver Denver uh, FedEx Airport and we are gonna go to Lamar Tex uh, Lamar somewhere somewhere east in Colorado Yep, we're going to Lamar, Colorado. Got 46,000 pounds to... Yeah, 46,000 pounds. Whole thing is going to be $404. Kind of sucks. We got packaged food. 
So without wasting any more time, let's get on out of here. 206 miles. Not too long, not too short. But um, we're going to get out of here and get this delivery done and the video finished. I don't want to rush it, but just saying. We're kind of a loud place right there. There's like a lot of commotion right there. Finally done and finished. We're gonna drive now, get this over with. Please open, thank you. And I'm not going to be one of those people where they just talk the entire time during the video. No hate to the people that do that, but I'm just not that type of person. I'm going to talk when I need to. I'm going to talk when necessary, you know. Just going to let you guys enjoy the ride. And I gotta say though, this blue on the truck, I love the new paint job that Swift has came up with. Old one was okay, I like the new one though. New one's pretty nice. I like the blue color on it. I like the way the trailer is. Even though we can't see it see a little bit of it but I don't want to get out the truck and I'm obviously not going to get out the truck look at that camera W900 right there engine brake dang that's what I would want and my first truck a camera W900 we'll see in the future though look at the train up there Wow, I think I'm gonna uh, adjust my audio settings in the next video. But yeah, I'm gonna try to be re as realistic as I can, okay? As realistic as I can, I'm not gonna break any laws, rules, or anything. Well, I'm 100% going to in the future, not in this video, but 100% going to. Should be our light, come on now. I'm not gonna do a, a swifty swift move. I'm not gonna do a swift move. I've seen those on the internet. Uh, I'm just not gonna do it. Not. I'm not going to do it. Of course. Why would I do it? You know. Go 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 go! Come on come on. Then we're like, got on the highway. Doing 35. Come on. Well, we are like 60,000 pounds. It is loud in here to me. We'll see how it is in the video, but whatever. Sorry if I drive like crap. Um, I'm not used to the Freyline or Cascadia at all. I normally drive Kenworth, Peterbilt, basically any other truck besides the Freightliner, Cascadia. I mean, I'll drive the Freightliner Century, you know, I'll drive the Freightliner FLD, but not Freightliner Cascadia, so look at that green. I like that Mustang over there. Uh, 
looks pretty, pretty good. Where's the turning lane? Where is it? It's right here. I was about to say, where is it? Dang, it's tight though. Why is it gotta be like that? It got to be slowing down ever everybody behind us. Uh, I do apologize if you guys hear some background noise of my steering wheel, pedals, shifter in the background. Or anything else, because this mic is sensitive. So, I do apologize for that. Don't know how to fix it. I don't know. And we got something happened. Slow traffic. I can hear the wind. I just wanted to see how the wind was. And this audio is too loud. Way too loud. I don't know how I feel about that. Yeah, it's a bit better now. This is my off, uh, uh, like, third time with the digital dash I never really do digital dash I'm not really a big fan of it but it's a 2022 Cascadia why not do it you know why not do it maybe in the next video me and my friend can go on that well, there's a bunch of little roads around the around the map, like little dirt roads that you can go on if you just cheap like use the what was it called the console. You can just teleport in there. Man, Colorado though is really beautiful. Look at the Kenworth, dang man, it looks sick. Well, my, my first truck, I would either want it to be a Freightliner, maybe a Freightliner like this, or a Kenworth T680. Is what I was thinking. Uh, that's what I was thinking. And I got zooming. That guy is zooming. He's probably going 80 just to pass me. Dang, dude. And I bet you we're gonna get pulled in. I bet you we're gonna get pulled in. Might as well slow down for it. It's gonna happen. Yep, I tell you. I mean, they gotta make these runways like just a little bit longer, dude. They do, because you don't really have any time to slow down. You're in a big truck. I want to drive realistic. That's what the game is. Well, it's a simulation, but come on now. You know what I mean? Like that Kenworth T680 over there. I would want something like that or like a sleeper. I'd probably go with the day cab first and then a sleeper. We'll see. Uh, 
I already know how much I weigh. See ya. there already ramps, you know, they're too short. Go, dude. Did you guys hear that? <laughs> That's my dog in the background. Wyoming, Colorado. I just called you Wyoming. roads stuck behind this guy Did I pass him I want to pass him dude I'm not staying behind him and I can't dude we're gonna go be going like 50 miles an hour the whole way to the metal man slam it oh no I don't know how I feel about the digital screen Slow down. <laughs> All right, we're here in somewhere. We are somewhere. I don't know where we are. We're actually going to get in this. I'm going to pass this guy. Bit too slow, man. Did you guys hear that plane? Oh, look at that. We got in front of him. <laughs> that was worth it. We 
just some curvy roads. Curvy roads. I remember going through here like two years, like, I don't know, uh, like two years ago or something. Uh, it was a year ago. A year ago. No, it was two years ago. Came through here, pitch dark, dude. It was so dark, the headlights were not doing anything. It was an older truck, so it had like halogen bulbs, but it was terrible. I had my high beams on, and these, like, you couldn't even see anything. That was crazy, like, I did not like it at the time, but I would do it again. Like, it, like, sucks in the moment, but in the, like, in the future, it gets better, you know. so annoying how they'll go on like the dot like they won't even go over one mile an hour for the speed limit it's honestly kind of annoying they'll make sure to never go over the speed limit Walmart what are you doing there Walmart hmm? delivering to a house or something Oh, dude. Fuck, man. You gotta slam on your brakes, dude. Come on, now. Sorry for cursing. Burger King. I don't know. I'm just saying random stuff. Well, it's kind of awkward, you know. First video with commentary, even though in the past I said I'll never do commentary on this channel doing commentary and I knew you guys were not expecting the kid to be doing all this look like we saw it look like we got some rain in, head of, in front of us or something we are just surrounded by purple clouds purple everything like light purple Kinda weird, man. Man, this trip is longer than I thought. Like farmlands over here. In the middle of nowhere. Just a bunch of farming equipment. Okay, we're getting back onto the open road. Nope, we're not. Dude, this transmission is going to go bad at the end of the video. Like, why is it, dude? That better not be my load back there. I think that was my load. All of that. Um, I don't know. What are you hauling again? I don't even remember what we're hauling. We're hauling something, though. I think we're hauling packaged food, I think. I have no idea. Oh, I'm fine. Dude, come on now. You can get over. You can get over. It won't hurt you. Jeez, man. Never mind. That's one of these way stations. You have to just yeet the whole truck into the runway. Well, at least we're in Lamar. Almost done. It's 84 degrees out. Dude, it is not all of like 84 degrees. Uh, 
I guess it does a little bit. Really, it, it didn't though. Earlier, it did not look like 84. Oh no, I think we're gonna have to go through the whole intersection just to get over to the, the left lane. Alright, we're good. We got all the room. No one's coming. We're good. Dang, dude, coming in hot. Can we not go straight? Uh, well, if we could go straight, the GPS would tell us. I don't know. We're just going to follow the GPS, even though you should never, ever, ever do that. Never follow your truck GPS. But I'm following. Oh, yeah, see, we could have gone that way. We could have gone that way. I don't even remember what we were hauling, so it's kind of like... A surprise to me. We'll see in a minute. Oh, it's one. Oh man, we gotta back up back there. I hate that one. We gotta worry about the truck. All right, we don't mind that. Okay. S stupid brake. I'm about to slam on the brakes. Brakes, dude. They suck. Like, how do you how do you slow down that fast? I mean, how do you slow down that slow? Look, we're about to slam on the brakes. Like, dude, no way. Alright, I'm a newbie, so we're gonna... Uh, man, the back window. Can't see anything out of it, so I'm gonna have to use my... It's different, dude. In a game, you're just looking at little pixels, but IRL, it's better. You know what, before we do anything, we're gonna go to key binds. I was gonna use that for zoom. And yeah, we are way off actually. Let's go look really quick. Yeah, we are off by a lot. Wow. That's pretty sad. Alright, let's just position ourselves a lot better. We're so close to Jack Niving. Wow, that was terrible. Okay, we should be good now. We're gonna have to cut it hard. Really hard right now. Alright, let's look in that mirror. Yeah, we're gonna have to cut it hard. Not so hard to where we're gonna jackknife. Okay, there's our trailer. Alright, so it's a little more. And pull up. Okay. You know, we get ourselves positioned a lot better than last time. First, I think we're... No, we're not good at all, actually. Yeah, we're not good at all. Well, that's fine. Watch, we're about to make ourselves a lot better right now. No, we're not. Okay. 
Well, now it's a straight back. So Got to pull up a lot. Wiggle the trailer around, and there we go. This wheel makes a lot of noise. And boom. Nice. Put these windows up. Nice. Put that parking brake in. I'm gonna set the truck off and we're gonna disconnect everything really quick. Actually, no, we're not going to do that. All right, let's just get done with this. We got an excellent 208 miles. Um, What were we hauling? Oh, yeah, packaged food. I knew it was packaged food. $404 from it. Oh, man. It's, I can't even look at it. It is what it is. I'll see. I'll, I'm going to stick around for a little bit, see how things turn out. Um... I'm excited for the series, like I said. Um, a lot more coming out. Um, but yeah. I'll see you guys in the next one. See you.